Hello and welcome back to the second episode of Minecraft How Rust Does It. Here we are back in Minecraft to explore our creative skills. I totally built this in less than five seconds. I'm joking. I'm using a mod called um, the Instant Structures mod. It's for version 1.7.10 as it hasn't been updated to 1.8 yet, but hopefully it soon will so other people who have the current latest version can test out this mod as well. This mod gives you a wide range of um, structures mods, uh, blocks which you can create such as um, stadiums to planes to farms to pens to keep your sheep in and all of that stuff. So mods are practically used to create a better environment for the Minecraft users um, to improve their gameplay. Ooh, a bit of a splashy splash then. Right, um, so yes, good afternoon, good morning, wherever you are. I hope you are having a really good day. I certainly am. What? Right, that's just silly. Whoever created this mod forgot that people can't jump up and open the door at the same time. That is ridiculous. So I am here to fix the job. Ta-da! Well done. And we will need one for this one as well. So yes, I'm thinking of um, keeping this as the main raw space um, for the next few couple of episodes until this place might burn down because you never know, you've got to be careful with what you do. Uh, so next second, your house could be from all the way up there to a couple of bricks laying on the floor. Right, our first challenge is we have got to try and get from the roof all the way to the ground in survival mode um, without dying. We are right on top of the main building of the Ross Corporation's institution, our main base. Right, so we are going to... Ooh, my splash of particles then. We are going to set our game... Um, is it? Slash game mode S. Yes it is. That's one. We are going to get rid of benches because benches, you know, you can't equip them in survival just magically. So this is it. Oh, that was quite a big jump. Oh, only two blocks down, but we didn't lose any health. That's good. Oh, can we do this? Can we actually do this? This I, I will be amazed if we can. <coughs> of course not. You cannot jump from a high building and survive. If you are enjoying this series so far, please leave a like, um, as it will be appreciated. I do take all my subscribers into um, coordination. Consideration, that's the one. Uh, it's night time. We don't want to be, we don't want it to be night time, we want it to be, to be day. So time set day. There we go. It's nice and blue in the sky. Not that blue. Well, at least it's not raining. Oh, you can actually go higher. I thought that was just the main bottom floor. And you can go higher? What? What is all this calamity? Is this the main roof? Is Oh no, you can go higher. Ooh. Higher we go. And that's just about it. This is the top floor. This is going to be our main view. Oh, it's like stepping into heaven. I'll be right back. I cannot tell you what I have been doing. It is all a secret. You must never sacrifice a goat to create a human. But here I am. I 
I'm about to sacrifice my own leg to create my wife. Say hello to what's your name? Your name's Rossinter. Yeah, come on. Uh, no, come on, come on. You're gonna be my new maid. Are you a man? If you're a man, then I have made an absolute total mistake and it would be really awkward if my maid turns out to be a man. As maid, maids have their title for a reason. All maids are women. Now come on, this way. I will take you on a journey. Oh yes, you are following me, come on. My new wife is called Rosinta, and she's going to help me um, with the cooking, the shopping. Don't worry, I will do a bit of help. Follow me. What the? Come here now. You think this is all part of a joke? You, I've hired you for a reason. You are working for me. Come on, this way. That's it. I've had enough. You know, if you're not going to listen to my orders. I suppose there's only one way to take you down. Um, not with an anvil. That'd be awkward. That'd be silly. Right, come on. Come on. I don't want to trade with you. I want to kill you. You are as useless to me as a green banana. There you go. Shots fired. Why won't you just get in? Well, that took some doing. Shifting this giant body into a little hole. Well, rest in peace, Rosinta. May you have a good life underground. As you barely did anything in real life except running away from your job. Who? Is. Who is that? What? Have. Have you. Have you regenerated? Yes, let me just... Yeah. Oh wow, this one's better than the first. This one's actually doing more work. Right, I've got a job for you. Um, Rosinta. You're a man. You used to be a woman. Wow, this is the opposite of Doctor Who. Because normally, all the doctors are male. There's never a female. But now, a female. Doctor turns into a male doctor. What an absolute commotion. Right, Rosinta the second. Um, I have a job for you. You can grow these carrots here, and I'm just going to um, go to the shop and get a, a Mazabaya. Yeah? Right, you, um, hi. Right, you can do the pumpkins instead. They look just like you. And try not to burn anything down. Alright, otherwise this house cost me uh, cost me a block. Just one block. Right. Um it's night time. I best go to the shop quickly. Ah well it was a bit late. I've I was talking to the shopman for a while. Whoa, what is this? What is going on? What? Who's caused this? I'm a doctor, but not the one you expected. Rosinta! Oh, when I find that man, I'm going to kill him. Ah! Well, not everything can be saved. I can't do anything but except watch this whole place burn to the ground. Oh, I will seek vengeance when I do find Rosinta. It will be his last breath. Joking, this wasn't even my house anyway. It was McGrilda's. Ah, uh, better expect this place to be in good condition. Hello? It was you, wasn't it? 
You killed Rossinta and then burnt my place down. Oh, I'm sending you to prison. Uh, come back here. Where have you gone? Oops, that's my window. Joking, it's it's your house, but if it's your house, why did you burn this place down? Magrilda. Why don't you take me to prison and I'll tell you everything you need to know? To be continued in episode 3, where we find out what happened on the night of yesterday between Magrilda and Rossinter. We will never know until tomorrow.